took a silver medal two weeks ago at the Commonwealth Games. Matthew Hudson-Smith keep an eye on lane four as we quickly scan across all eight men in this final. Hudson-Smith just taking his time to come in from the presentation to get to his marks. They've already been out there to set their blocks. It's difficult to see anybody beating Hudson Smith. It's going to require a real major improvement from any of these men to really challenge Hudson Smith. Two other Britons have won back-to-back -back European titles. Roger Black and Martin Rooney. Could Matthew Hudson Smith be the third man in European Championships history and the third Briton to win two consecutive titles over one lap of the track as they settle down Zalowski of Poland in lane one Spitz of Switzerland in two Hordier of France in three Hudson Smith the favorite Great Britain in four Bonavaccia the Netherlands Haydock Wilson Great Britain in six Borle of Belgium in seven and on the outside Petrucciani of Switzerland and they're away and it is indeed Matthew Hudson Smith who's started very, very quickly. He's closing down already on Bonavaccia. Also running well, Haydock Wilson out in lane six. It's the two Britons at the moment who are really pouring it on over the first half of this race. Haydock Wilson having a really good first 200 metres as they come into the second bend. Hudson Smith now tired just a little bit down the back straight, but it's Haydock Wilson now holding on but overtaking him on the inside, running a terrific bend and really going through the gears down the home straight. It's as we expected, Hudson Smith pouring it on. He's got a European title to defend and he's doing it with aplomb. Petrucciani comes through a distant second, but there's no doubting at all. Unofficially, 44-54, European champion once again. It's Great Britain's Matthew Hudson Smith. A season for Matt Hudson-Smith retaining his 400 metre title. When he won in Berlin, everyone was saying, oh, we knew that was coming for ages. And then it was a torrid four years for Matt Hudson-Smith on and off the track. Patrick Gianni of Switzerland doing some nice celebrations there as well. Matt Hudson-Smith, three championships, three medals, and Alex Haydock wilson gets the bronze. That was a brave run from Alex Haydock wilson He committed early on thought today might be the day he'd sneak under 45 seconds, but I'm sure he'd take a bronze medal instead. Here's a few stats. Matthew Hudson-Smith's winning time, just one hundredth of a second outside the long-standing European Championship record of Ewan Thomas, which dates back to 1998. Ricky Petrocciani, just one hundredth outside his own personal best. Alex Haydock-Wilson, a cracking run from the young Briton. 900 outside his personal best. Matt Hudson Smith works with his coach Gary Smith, the same coach as Stephen Gardner, Gary Evans. Apologies, mixing up their surnames, they're not related. Um, but Gary Evans loves to have his athletes work on different parts of the races, and I very much felt Matt, Matt Hudson Smith was relaxed through that first 200. And it was at 150 that he started to kick in. We've seen him practice those different parts of the race in various rounds at the British Championships, at the World Championships, Commonwealth Games, and at the Europeans. I think that was the race plan here. Finish hard, power down that home straight, and nobody could lift with the change of pace of Matt Hudson Smith. I wonder if he can set his sights on that European record and perhaps some Diamond League races. And it was a brilliant finish for the young Swiss athlete in second. And look at Alex Haydock wilson giving it everything to stay ahead of Lee Marvin Bonavaccia for the bronze medal. Came down to the thousandth to decide the final medal. Well, you were talking about the European record. That stood to Thomas Schoenleber since 1987 when he won the world title in Rome. 44-33. Matt Hudson-Smith improved to 44-35 earlier this season. And this is not a quick track. We've seen that in the sprint times. We know that it's an old track. It's been repaired. It's been refurbished. That was a terrific run from Matt Hudson-Smith. He, he has said this year that he doesn't care too much about the times. He just wants to add to his medal collection. That's exactly what he's done. Petrucciani, someone who only three years ago was a European under-20 
medalist, and that was bronze, so senior three years later and one higher step on the podium. There's confirmation of the results. Matt Hudson-Smith.